Hello, this is Pepperboy, and welcome to Top 10 Tips for Rocket Bot Royale Beginners. Tip number one is create an account. This might seem obvious to you, but there are some players with over a thousand games played who don't even have an account. So if the game doesn't sign them in for some reason, or if they want to go to another device, they'll have to start all over from the beginning. And now on to tip number two, do your goals. Head over to the second tab to the left and you'll see all of these cool goals. After you complete one, it takes 24 hours to refresh, so every second counts. These are the only way to progress in the game and get all of these cool rewards. And now into tip number three, make friends using friend codes. If you go to the friends tab on the top of the screen, you will see a thing saying my friend code. Then if you click on it, it will copy it to your clipboard. Then you can paste it and show it to other people. And then they can enter it into this box and click plus, and then they will be added. And now into tip number four, which is adding on to tip number three, and it's invite your friends into squads. If you click on form a squad and then invite a friend, you can invite anyone that you have friended and is online. And then you'll be in the same game together and on a team. And now into tip number five, the one that everybody asks for. How do you get the escapists and great escape badges? Both of these badges are gotten by digging out through the bottom of the map. The escapist one is leaving the map. And the second one, the great escape, is getting the beach ball which spawns in the lobby out of the bottom of the map. So now I'll show you how to get both of them in the same game. By the way, all of this is in squads because squad lobbies fill up slower than solo lobbies. So what you do is you join a game and then you wait for it to get 20-ish people. And then you leave the lobby and you get three nukes and three rapid fires, or if you have it, get three drills, but that's at level 10. So for this part, you need to get kind of lucky because you need to spawn in right next to the beach ball or as you go on your way down to the bottom. That's why I suggest you to do this with friends because that means more chance of getting the beach ball. So at least one of you need to get the beach ball out and then the rest go to the bottom. Or if you're doing this solo, just get it out and then go to the bottom. And then spam with your rapid fires and nukes and get out of the lobby. And then the beach ball should go out, but sometimes it just bounces around and it doesn't work. So if you do that, you should get the escapist and great escape badge. They should show up after you leave your game. And now onto tip number six, shoot multiple times to kill. So when you're in a fight, instead of just shooting once, shoot two or three times, and then you can either like get through the ground and hit them, or if you hit them multiple times, they'll die because it takes two shots to kill people unless you have damage perk. And now onto tip number seven, shoot in two places. This is pretty much an advanced version of the last tip. Just shoot once and then move a bit and then shoot again where you think they're going to go. But we're not all boop like in this clip. This is just absurd. But if you can get good at this, it's really helpful for becoming a better Rocketbot Royale player. And now on to tip number eight, get in the air. So if you stay on the ground while you're in a fight and the enemy has like a line of fire at you, that's not a good idea. What you should do is you should go into the air and then try to shoot at them from above because it's harder to hit tanks while they're in the air. That's true in real life too. And now onto tip number nine, get the high ground. This helps in a fight because you don't have to work against gravity and you can shoot further than your opponents. And at the end of the game, you can stay above the water for the longest if you have the highest ground. And now for tip number 10, which is look for gems around the map. Gems are really good for extra, oh wait, no, not those kind of gems. Gems are really cool people. It's a nice name, oh wait, no, not that kind of gem either. Oh yeah, like, like the money gems, oh okay, yeah. 
If you go mining around the map, you can find some gems. Gems can be used to refresh your goals and to buy stuff from the shop. Thank you for staying to the end of the video. If you want an extra tip for your time, it is to join the Rocketbot Royale Discord. You can get people to join your squads to help with Escapist and the Great Escape, and just have a good time. The link is in the description.